you are now watching to latest salon gossip and entertainment channel please subscribe please subscribe welcome to latest salon gossips and entertainment channel please subscribe and don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Latest Salon Gossips and Entertainment. And on Facebook at Latest Salon Gossips and Entertainment. K. Mann explained on in recent interview on how he struggled before he became successful in his music career. The hitmaker gives a clear statement that things were not easy for him. When he was coming up. I'm going to bring to you the video. But please don't forget to subscribe and hit on the notification for more updates. Well, this is a very, very good question, this, because the story to this one is super long. But I will try for cut and short, short, you know. When I go Guinea, to be honest with you, we get stranded, you know. You know, so during the war, things will not be normal. You know, we be they really get stranded. So I went through a lot, my brother. At times, some things that they're not nice for toxic, to be honest. You know, because Guinea have been other man country, you know, even food, bruh, will not be the eat. You know, even show so you go eat every day. I promise you, man. So, yeah. And um, I've been getting this, my friend. They don't die now. Let Allah get a good road. Dos, we not like we them. You know, Dos, not be super talented guy, you know. He can always encourage me. Say, come and listen, you know, no matter what. Can you imagine? We'll be to go look for studio in a Guinea. We'll not even get transport for pay for good, bruh. We'll walk out over 30 miles for go find studios. Go and come. We'll not even get food. You know, you don't even get food for go for eat for go studio. I'm not going to say for go pay now for studio. So it's almost impossible. So we did Guinea for, for like a year. I don't record one song, to be honest with you. So going for the, um, I can't see this guy with me in this salon. We're not Silan Kuchi. We're the blind musical flames. I don't know if you know Silan Kuchi, blind musical flames. Yeah, I know about them. Um, yeah. Yeah. So somebody hooked me up with them. Um, you know, so can you imagine? Um, I be the gonna sell any host. Now me the gonna market for your wife. All the money me the me the me the keep it. Then they far from Musa me be there. No me be there at home. Then they keep it. So it's far. I not even be the take transport. I wake very early in the morning after prayer. I walk I gonna sell any house. I go wash in wife in pan. Yeah. I take him picking in a school. I gonna market. Then turn the sell can go play in a band. You know he can kind of money. So he can sleep. I did that for close to one year. For no more less, record for me one green song, which he never did. You know, now they laugh about him. I remember the other time he came to me, we said, oh, they laugh, say, okay, man, you know, you struggle. I can tell people him and all that. So you're very perseverant and all that. So, like, still, I'm always be the balance, man. I may be the only hand, because the blind man, you know, they see. When you can get contract for go play in a different studio, then I may the carry and go. I go sit down when they want to go buy food. I may go send for go buy a cookie, a cow, sit down, eat, he left, give me a eat. With the Panande one year, still on every record for me one song. I remember one pretty day, me mommy sent for me gown. Yeah. Me mommy sent for me one gown. Because me mommy be the free tone. So he sent for me one gown. Um, he meet up still on him daddy be the right and letter say, since pretty they come, he need a gown. Yeah, so when me daddy send give me this gown, when me mommy send give me this gown, um, I show Sila and I say, ah, be me glad, you know, like where you mommy go send for you, go be happy, you know. I show Silan, I say, Silan, listen, my mommy don't send for me this gown, and I'm so happy, my pretty don't boil and all that. Subscribe. Then Silan say, uh huh, come on, he said, my daddy said they asked me for gown. He say, I'm not going to buy this gown, I am. Now I say, Silan, listen, not buy this gown, I am. I go give this gown, do for me one song. That's how no go come about. So I give Silan the gown, he play for me, no go beat. When he play for me, no go beat. I get this beat. Um, I go to one guy with a called Prince Catching Studio. Go lay vocals there. So now be the only I, song that they are doing. Just the beat it provide for you. It provide the beat for me. It not even give me the, the vocals. Yes, it just provide normal beat for me. Oh my God. Yeah, so he give me this beat now. So maybe get for hustle now. I go to one guy with a called Prince Cant. Yeah, I be go pay a small money. By then, for raise hundred thousand, bro, it go take you six months. I promise you, man. Because those days now, what you eat, you almost get. You know, so. It not be easy, so I go to Prince Car to record no go. So I left the file there because I don't be getting anything better for do it. I not be promoting by myself. So Charles Ostro will be the salon where be the work with the paradise by then. I think himself be the fan way for go Israel, but be the Guinea. So according to Charles Ostro, 
it be they try for accumulate some money because you not get ticket money for go back now Israel. So because of that, it be they work in a different studio than way then they pay them for they get some money for buy ticket for go. So fortunately for me, you go work in a Prince Cutting studio, he listen no go. Where he listen no go, he say, who don't do this song? So the guy tell him, say, I want to see a Bobo, this and that, the guy go, this and that, ta-ta-ta. So he say, he want to see me. So when, when they bring me now to him, he can't be like, see me and be the work in a paradise before. So we just connect. So he tell me about my potentials. He tell me, say, I get a long way for go, this and that, if we can do an album together, and all that and all that. So which I accept, because I don't get away, I don't get choice, you know? But child says if not be get money, remember I tell you saying self be the try for fan ticket for go. Okay. You know, all what you be get na sababu because people they can't pay money for go produce song to them. So what you self be they do when they pay money, that money they self they pay some for do beats for me. Then in be get some beats that already will be done in Israel, we be doing in computer. So that's how we manage, you know. Me and Charles go live together now. And um, but Charles be the get stranded. If I tell you this man. And I'm not going to be ashamed for talking this in the media. I remember one time we trust a check and put Charles in a cell. <laughs> I'm telling you, my brother, man. We trust a check over six months to the trust no money to pay, bro. You know, because that's money, no, money, money, money not there at all, at all. <laughs> <laughs> money not there, bro. That's how bad it was, bro. You know, so, yeah. Uh, finally, we get to do this album with help of so many people. To be honest with you, I don't want to be ungrateful. Not to one person help, because me and Stra- Charles will get a project to be get stranded. To be honest, you know, so other people in be the chipping, and um, even also I may be lodge to me mommy when they cook when they put me on food. I get for take me on food. I bring them to Charles for we can eat. My goodness. So wait now after now now, now before Charles come off free town or now after I wanna do this now that that, that can and go free town. No, Charles be the free town. Charles be the free town on the Paradise Records. Okay, so now when it come up free town, now it go na Guinea now. Go it go na Guinea for finding way back for go back because he said one turn back in country. Okay, but you know we get tickets, so it go stuck na Guinea. So that's how we met. Okay, so but can I ask you this question? You know, a successful musician. Well, it, it depends. What do you mean by successful musician? <laughs> you actually don't realize with all this struggle where you don't go through, say, today, because me saying I'm Muslim, I get, I get strong faith. Say, Alhamdulillah, I don't regret being a musician. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Definitely. I don't ever regret being a musician. And um, in that terms, yes, I'm super, super successful. So uh, somebody go once say, uh, now then struggle and the way you go through, uh, now the blessing follow you. Well, same way. So, yeah, because I believe so, because I do them genuinely, because at times again, Allah, they see through we art, you know what we want. It be always in my prayer. I say, if God, they give me one million units per other thing, they give me 500 per music. That's how much I love music. You know, the reason why I ask you this question now for the young musicians and where they come up, we just we say things ain't going to happen very easy. As they get small challenges, Oh, the next moment, and they blame people about them. Um.